old. Well, a miracle many times over. Last year, we met Nicholas Koch, a Pueblo baby born with a rare birth defect. He never grew a brain, only a brain stem. Doctors didn't think he'd survive hours, let alone days. Well, tonight, he's celebrating his second birthday. News First 5's John Romero live with one of your stories. John? Lisa, unfortunately, since the last time we saw Nicholas, his condition has gotten worse. But with the unyielding love of his family behind him, the little boy continues to defy odds and warm many hearts. Two years later, it's like it's gotten stronger. Last year, we introduced you to baby Nicholas Koch. This miracle baby was born without a brain, and doctors said he would die just a few hours after birth. Yet, he made it an entire year. On Tuesday, he still defies science as he celebrates birthday number two. It's just been an emotional roller coaster ever since the day he was born. It's just, we're just really lucky he made it to be two. The family includes Nicholas in everything they do, even taking him on his first ever camping trip this summer. Knowing the baby can pass at any time, they try to live every day like it may be his last. He gives us a challenge every day because you never know if he's if this is our day or we get another day. Lately, things have taken a turn for the worse. Nicholas now must take 12 different medications daily, eight alone for seizures. In his passing, uh, one of the signs is they sleep more and they eat less, and that's the way he's been lately. Um, the last two months he's gone down. But he never suffers alone. We pull through as a family. No one can say for sure just how much longer baby Nicholas will be on this earth. But even in only two years of life, he's left an indelible mark on the lives of everyone who's ever met him. I can't believe it's mine. I can't believe it. You know, he came to, to me like he was sent here for a reason for me. Whether it was for me to learn how to love more or what, but he's just, he's my angel. He's my everything. Now, baby Nicholas can't see or hear anything, but incredibly, he seems to know when either his mom or his grandma is holding him. It's both amazing and very touching to see. Lisa? Boy, a lot of love. Okay, thanks so much. And we are always looking for stories from you in our community. If you have a story to, a story to share, you can email us or contact us through Facebook or Twitter.